Two master artists, three summers, thousands of man hours, and four provincial grants later, and the Fraser Street mural has finally reached completion since its creators came up with the idea four years ago. Uh, we looked at the culture on the street and the organizations that help people, and we thought, well, a cultural mosaic would be awesome to do, and then it just went from there. The theme, shift from walking on earth to walking as earth. The mural is an interpretation of the cultural history of Prince Rupert. Beauty, especially in art, is in the eye of the beholder, and Soul Feather hopes it will be a source of pride and education for the community. Cultural pride, um, aesthetic beauty, uh, also to value uh, our resources, uh, not as something that we need to exploit, but something that is part of ourselves, part of our survival, um, and also um, just coming together and, and with seeing the truth of what's happened and what is happening, uh, just coming together and, and uh, realizing our choice as creators as we move forward. Fraser Street was chosen as a location for the mural because of the history of the street. It was also an area of concern since it's somewhat hidden from the arterial roads in town. When they did a community mapping project, Fraser Street was identified as an area of concern for infrastructure, for the sidewalks in the street and safety issues. Uh, when we started looking at the history, it has a wonderful history. So much happened on this street. It, it was a real heart of the community and it still is. Coincidentally, the mural was finally completed just days before the arrival of the Communities in Bloom judges, who will also be judging the Fraser Street Wall. For CFTK TV News in Prince Rupert, I'm Sahar Nassimdust.